so, talking of corporate insanity, uh, or co shall we say, the scourge of corporate wokery yes. strikes again. Mm. I mean, have you seen the Costa Coffee ads? Uh, the, uh, they are ridiculous, aren't the they? Trans when, I saw, when I first saw it yesterday, I thought it was a parody. Yeah, I the thought trans this must be a parody scars, account, surely to God. With sort of scars underneath uh, his breasts. Yeah. Uh, uh, trans man with a double mastectomy. I mean, that, that's to promote Costa Coffee. Mm. And you think, well, fine, if you want to make that advert, fine. But what does Costa... It isn't fine, though, is it? What does Costa think it's going to get out There's of this There's a picture advert? there. And why is it, you know, what's fine about it? Why, what, why do they feel the need to have to do that? As somebody pointed out on Twitter today, so putting topless pictures of women are fine uh, on uh, adverts now, as long as they're actually uh, uh, without their breasts. I know. Yeah, good point. I mean, my, my point is, is what I mean in fine, you know, it's a free world, a free country, you can do it if you want, but what do you think, as a company, you're going to get out of it? This will appeal to a tiny minority, and I would suggest seriously alienate the vast majority. Uh, so this is crazed corporate virtue signalling that will cost Costa Coffee mm. a lot. Well, I've seen a lot of people saying they're never going back to Costa I Coffee know, anymore. What, what, they're not going to get any what? coffee from them. This reminds me of uh, Bud Light. Yes, eh? And uh, what's her name? Uh, Dylan. Yes. The uh, trans woman that they uh, hired to promote Bud to Light. To kill off their, uh, their and brand. And I think, I think Bud, Light is Bud Light is battling to survive. Yeah. It was America's most drunk beer. Yeah. Now it's on the bread line and it may go under. And the company has lost about 20 billion yeah, or something, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, of course it has. The share price has plummeted. Yeah. Uh, the brand is in the toilet and uh, guess what? The brilliant marketing director who came up with it, a woman, has been fired. Yeah. I mean, unbelievable. I know. Unbelievable.